After reports to News 4 of issues with the Porter Service at the Providenciales International Airport, we visited the airport to see firsthand. Safety is a major concern and there is a need to implement order at the curb. And as reported on August 25th, our cameras caught video of the porters in no uniform, running in the road with their trolleys behind taxis and other vehicles, ignoring the proper safety measures. Today, August 26th, News 4 spoke with Taryn Smith, who is the curbside supervisor at the Providenciales International Airport. The, the government has just taken control of the airport. Some other people had owned the airport before, but the government has the airport now. Mr. John Smith, he is the CEO of the airport, and he inherit whatever is going on here, he has inherited. But he is doing what he could to fix this. He has hired me to help him to fix this situation here with the porters. A lot has already been done. I mean, it might not seem so, but we have came quite a way in just three weeks. But there's more, there's still more that need to be done. He said very soon residents will see the porters properly attired and their aim is to meet international standards. They're getting uniforms for the porters. We're getting name tags for the porters. We're getting new trolleys for the porters. We are trying to establish this on an international level. But it's going to take time. I mean, this didn't just get so in a couple of months. This, this was going on for years and years. And it's going to take a while to bring these guys under control. Newly appointed Smith said so far everything is going well. But the changes have been difficult for porters as they've been on their own for a while. He said there are plans to place three porters on the inside of the airport terminal with proper uniform and badges. Now on the issue of the porter's employment. Smith said some are not employed by TCI Airports Authority, but some are students working for the summer. News 4 will continue to follow this story. For WIV4 News, I'm Takara Bain.